from Swift Kick here. No, I am not here to talk about my highlighter sweatshirt that I know you're staring at right now. I'm actually here to talk to you about Casewell Drive. I know you're like, where is Casewell Drive? It doesn't matter where it is but it is an actual community where people live on it, such as Ricky. And I learned this story about Ricky where what they do at Casewell Drive is every Friday, anyone on that street can walk out onto the curb, take a tiki torch, plant it firmly into the ground, and then light that tiki torch. That sends a signal to everyone else on Casewell Drive that if you in front of your house have a tiki torch that's lit up, your house is open for anyone to come by after work to enjoy some food, drink, fun, friends in their backyard. The rules are actually of the Tiki Torch tradition are pretty simple. First off, anyone can host it. Multiple people can host it. Second, the party starts once the Tiki Torch is lit and the party ends once the Tiki Torch is exhausted. That's it, those are the rules. Super simple, but this tradition on Casewell Drive has expanded to other roads nearby and other streets where they want to come and participate as well. So Casewell has now opened it up to allow other streets to come and join. Guess what happened? The property value on Casewell Drive shot through the roof. The parties were so popular, the homeowners and nearby wanted to participate. People wanted to live on Casewell Street. The Casewell Tiki Torch Tradition, that's a tongue twister. Tiki Torch Tradition highlights really two truths about human. The first is that we are social beings and we have a strong desire to be bigger than something than ourselves. And so when you think about engagement within your community, don't just think about how you can have someone participate or attend your event or your meeting or your organization, but really think about how you can give them a sense of belonging. I remember I was speaking to Blake Williamson, who used to work at, as the director of student engagement at Trinity Valley Community College. And he said to me one day, you know, Tom, we don't invite students to events, we invite them to belong. The second thing that this highlights, traditions within our community matter because traditions create the social habit of engagement and belonging. When there's that tradition that's going on, people can't help themselves but want to be a part of it. People see that tiki torch go on the ground, it gets lit up, and they're like, it's Friday, I'm going to go hang out with Ricky and all the other neighbors and have a drink, play some games, and hear some stories, and then I'm going to head home. So it's not just a street we live on, but now it's a community we live in. My name's Tom here at Swift Kick. We're always here trying to help you build your communities, increasing the engagement and the retention within your members. Take care till next time. Hope you light that tiki torch tonight.